Good, good morning. morning. Um, we just want to say good morning. Any kids and parents, grandparents who are watching, anyone else that is, um, we just wanted to pray for you today. And before we go into prayer, um, I just want to um, talk about something real quick. So yesterday, Pastor Ken was talking about um, how Judas betrayed Jesus and how um, he went to Gethsemane to pray. And while he was there, he prayed about um, something that uh, I think I want to focus on today. Go for it. And so he prayed. Um, he had just a little urge. You know, like sometimes we're, we don't want to do something God is calling us to do. Or it may be really hard and we're just like, I don't know if I can do this. So Jesus had this moment where he was like, you know what, God, please take this from me. But you know, if it's your will, let it be. Let your will happen. Um, not my will, but yours. And so um, today, me and Nathan were doing this discussion, um, and we had this little devo um, from Take 5, and it was talking about David, but it, the main purpose of it was those but God moments where maybe God is calling us to do something. Maybe he's calling us to pray for someone or to mm -hmm. help someone in need, or maybe it's just to do something that um, we've been putting off. And we're like, mm, that'll come later. Or we're saying, you know what? Like, I need to read the word. But God, I really don't have time. And so he said, I just want to encourage you guys. Yeah. Like, we need to take off those but gods and say, mm -hmm. yes, God. Um, Any time where we feel, because that's just fear. And when we have fear, that's the enemy. And the enemy's like, he doesn't want us to say, yes, God. He wants us to say, but God. And, but God, I don't want to do this. But God, I don't have time. He thrives in that. He wants us to say, yes, God, I will do that. Yes, God, let me help them. I have joy in helping. I have joy in doing this. And so when things are uncomfortable, it's okay. As long as we trust in him, everything's going to be okay. And so um, today I just want to pray over us and just encourage us to just put off all of those but gods and say, yes, God. Right. And so, God, I just thank you for today. I thank you for just waking us up, God, and giving us another day, even when things seem like they're crazy and it's not our normal, God. Um, we just pray that you allow us to listen to you, what you have to say for us, God, what you have called us to do, what you ask us to do each and every day, whether it's us to help someone that we see, whether it's to pray for someone, whether it's just to open up the word, God, or start something that we haven't started in a long time out of fear, God. We just ask that you allow us to stop saying, but God, I don't want to do this, but God, I don't have time, and just say, yes, God, I will do this. And I just pray that you be with everyone today, and you just let us have joy, even when it's sometimes it's hard to have that, God. And I just thank you in Jesus' name. Now, Pastor Nathan. Yes. Don't you have a scripture verse for us today? I have a quick scripture verse for us guys, and we're going to go to Isaiah. And I was reading this, and it's just really encouraging over these times where we may be saying, uh, but God, this doesn't look possible. And we put in that, we put in our own doubt whenever we can't understand this. And then I was in uh, Isaiah 41, verse 10, and it says, So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not dismay, for I am your God, and I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous hand. And it's like, when we feel, feel like during this time, like, I don't know, or there's concern, or I don't know how to start something, I don't know what to do, how is this going to happen? The Lord's like, He's already there with us. He's going to be there every single moment of our life and he's saying it's okay don't don't give this but god i can't but but a but god you can and it's just a moment to know that even in our weakness he's our strength and we know that throughout this day no matter what happens no matter what storm we come across it's going to be calmed it we're going to get through this and we're going to have the memory of the storm that we went through, but the victory and the testimony of the things that we saw. Mm. Well, yeah. we're so happy to share this with you. And we hope that you 
have a wonderful rest of the day and have yes. a wonderful what was that joke that you were gonna make um yes <laughs> so when i'm not cheesy well i'm not normally cheesy but when i am mm -hmm. i'm super cheesy mm -hmm. um and i just want to say have a good, good friday. friday bye guys bye we guys. love you love you